Hello, welcome to another episode here at Big Man in the Woods. I'm Mark, helping you deliver practical skills. Now in this vlog, we're talking about this bad boy. Woo! Now it's not my invisible cloak, no. It's my campfire blanket. And why am I talking about it in this vlog? Well, I thought it'd be quite cool because we've been talking about it at my scouts about this camp blanket and how these different badges all represent something really, really different. And I was thinking that maybe I should share the love of this good old camp blanket. Now, this one, bad, but we'll talk about that one in a few seconds. Now, why am I talking about camp blankets? Well, there's a lot of history behind this camp blanket that no one really knows why. Uh, so Baden Powell, he brought this camp blanket. Rumor is, it's from the Native Americans, because we know that BP based a lot of scouting all on the Native Americans. And they used to wear ponchos like this, big woolly ones, sat around the campfire when it was cold. And BP, BP took inspiration from that, just like he took the necker. He took the, that inspiration from the Native Americans. And that's all we really kind of know about this camp blanket. No one knows... Truly, if it was from the Native Americans, no one even knows what year it was. All that we know as scouters all around the world is that we love a good old camp blanket. Now, in this one, I'll try and step back a bit. I made it into a, a poncho. And I've... Thanks to my mother-in-law. Uh, she's a good seamstress. She's added these hooks... I don't know if we can see that on camera and it just hooks up into a poncho okay so i put these hooks onto here as well as doubling up as my blanket at night time i can wear it sat around the campfire nice and wool keeps me nice and, and warm but what is the point of a campfire blanket well it's about sharing memories isn't it on a camp blanket there's no exact way of doing anything it's not like por where we only can have particular badges on these things my blanket here is full of different memories yeah lots and lots and lots and lots of badges and these badges all represent different things <laughs> Look at this one, one of my favourites, the badge police. <laughs> and we've got a, a, don't forget, this one says forget Brexit, carry on scouting. What have we got here? A steam train, first ever steam train I went on with my family. Different things, all different memories. And this is the beauty of having your own camp blanket, isn't it? You put badges on that you want to put on. Um, it's not all about scouting, is it, you know? This one isn't a scouting badge. Maybe many people will recognize it as Paul Frank. Uh, me and my wife are big fans of Paul Frank and monkeys. Well, in particular me. The Incredibles. Nothing to do with scouting. But I love the video or the cartoon, whatever you want to say it about. So this blanket all represents different stories. Uh, earlier on, when I had it in my poncho, I had a Coldstream Guard badge. Let me try and find that one. That's the thing about this badge. Blanket, this lots and lots of badges on here there it is this is the badge i was talking about nothing to do with scouts but in fact it, it was my dad's my dad was in the Coldstream guards and it's from his uniform so that's on there whoops uh that's on there too always my dad is always with me when i'm scouting it's that kind of thing and there's no right or wrong re way to do a scout blanket i've seen badges on it i've seen neckers on it I've seen different designs. There's no exact way, no exact design of how to do a camp blanket. People do it all different ways. There might be badges on here that people go, why have you got that on it? Because it's mine, it's all personal. And this was what I've been sharing with my scouts, is to get badges, U-shaped badge there, and put it on there. And those badges will always be with you from every camp. All this favourite money. You know, you can point to a badge here and I can tell you a little story about what it what it represents. Who does it mean? And this is what I think we need to do in scouting is bring back the camp blanket. People see it as a geeky thing. Oh, it's one of those. It's not. It's about having sharing those memories. And it is, it is very practical sitting around the campfire at night time. When it's a bit chilly, we can put it on. 
and keep nice and toasty and warm. Um, but as you can see, I cheated on a few of these badges. I glued them on. I used badge glue, and that's a big no-no, guys. If you're going to do it, do that proper way and sew it on like I did with my Scoutadelic badge. Sew it on because uh, there's another one. Scout radio badge is coming off where I use badge glue. And after a while, the badge glue just peels off. So if you're going to do it, put a bit of time into it and sew your badges on. Yeah? I'd love to see your favorite photos of your camp blanket uh, badges as well. And how do you put your blanket together? My scouts are now putting them together. I know that we had a big story because we fundraised for the Australia bushfire. And there's a badge that I haven't sewn on it that I will sew on it this weekend. Um, we raised money just over £300, the group, uh, to send off to the uh, Australian Scouts um, and the Wildlife Trust in Australia. And that's all about making memories, making those connections. And when we pick up a badge, we might have been on the camp that we've forgotten about. Or we've swapped badges with someone in another county in another country, in fact. You know, you've been to a jamboree. And that's what this bad boy, this blanket... Is all about and as we know us scouters we love a good badge don't we and don't forget you can get one of these badges one of these ones a big man in the woods camp blanket badge if you want one of those uh, all the details are on the website so guys thank you very much for uh, watching this video about campfire blankets I'd love to see your blanket send me a little email with a photo tag me in however you want to do it and that's very good. Love it. Don't forget to click up here if you want to see some more of my scout related vlogs. Until next time, guys, happy camping. Over and out. And remember, always do your best.